Hello, so mates. Welcome and good evening. All right. So, in this video, I want to show you how to cut um, this wonderful combat pocket pattern. Now, this pattern is used in making a combat pocket, as you can see. So, I will take you through the steps of how this was cut and drafted, and possibly I will also show you how to sew it with a fabric so you will learn and understand so if you derive this video interesting don't forget to like share comment ask your questions and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so let's get down to the cutting proper <laughs> All right, guys. So now let's get down to the cutting proper. So here I will work with um, with the pattern paper so that it will be easier for me to transfer on my main fabric. So let's work with pattern paper, right? So first and foremost, the first thing to do here is to decide the width of your pocket and also the height of your pocket. So the width of my pocket will be. 8 inches width, 8 inches deep, that's the length, right? 8 inches this way, and then maybe um, 7, or let's do 9 depths and 7 widths, right? So you're the one to decide on the measurement you want to use. There is no specific measurement for any pocket. For once it's combat, you're the one to decide on how big you want it to be. So the first thing to do is to get a fabric like this, give space here and then mark a line just like this and let's make here to be 8 inches so I'm dropping 8 inches line here and then I will thicken this line to that 8 inches right 8 inches length and then the pocket width like, like we agreed let's use um. 6.5 right let's make adjustments or seven let's use seven right let's use seven so you mark seven inches width here right so mark seven inches width seven inches width mark all through that way and then you connect so here you make sure you also get a straight line Make sure you get a straight line all through here that corresponds with this. So get a straight line all through here that corresponds with this. So carefully mark this. So get a straight line in this form. And then this comes all through this way. And then confirm that you have eight inches as well right here you mark and then connect this way you know in doing this you need to be your hands need to be stretched and you need to be careful so now i will use my marker here and thicken these lines so that you will know that these are the main this is the main pocket right so i'll just thicken these lines just like this Bear in mind that I'm trying to show you the pattern. So you can just mark this once and keep with you so that you will use it to cut multiple pockets whenever you are working. So on this area, extend this line. Extend this line by two inches this way and also go here as well. So now, after marking that, the next thing to do is to mark one inch high one inch high one inch high just like this and also extend just watch this video carefully you understand it and also extend extend this other one you know to go up through this way extend this one as well to come all through this way then connect this from here 
and go all through this way fine so this is the base of your pocket right so now let me label okay i will label later now after you have done this now the next to do is to mark one inch on both ends one inch on both ends an extra half right one one inch on both ends an extra half so carefully do this one inch this way one inch and then half an inch so this is what you will mark so mark it as well in this form one inch here one inch here and then half of an inch also mark somewhere here one inch here one inch here and also half of an inch right at the base at the downside mark one inch as well one inch as well and then half of an inch right fine so now you have marked this i will use my um blue pen to connect first so you understand how it goes so this line this one inch line you marked here must correspond the edge must correspond with this it must reach to this edge you get it must reach to this edge so this line will come all through from here and go all through to this point right fine so now if the mark you have here like we have is seven inches right we have seven inches width by eight inches depth right seven inches width by eight inches depth now um the first thing you will do here is to mark one inch lesser at the base here one inch lesser at the base here so since here is seven so here will be um six inches right it will be six inches so now you measure the distance here you get um the midpoint now you can still decide to you know okay let's bring the lights down with the, with the man um, with the light pen so later on we will join with the marker so you understand the major lines that we are connecting right so this light pen now will be like the main thing or the foundation or the guide so just you know bring them down bring them down so let's just bring this light down with our light pen the letter will use our marker to do the, the thickening right so just bring them down all through this way and also mark this as well to go all through this form so now we have gotten to this stage so the first thing we need to do here is if you measure the total distance here is eight right so you might not one from this and mark seven you get why this other one will be eight right so do the same thing here mark seven here and mark eight at this point so once you have gotten that mark now see what you do join the edge of this pocket here to that one inch lesser it goes in this form and then join it here as well from here it comes in this form you know to make this curve very important so join from here to go to this point join from here to come to this point so this looks more of like architectural drawing but it gives you a perfect pocket size right so now since you have gotten to this point then just take this line to move straight down and meet this one here so it will meet it at one inch inside also take this line as well 
to move straight down until it meets the line here right so this is the first step you are going to take and don't forget that the second line down must be must be equal with this that's somewhere here the last last line down must be what equal with this that's somewhere here then after you have gotten to that point then connect this point from here connect this point from there to this point just like this and also connect that point from here to this point it comes like this right fine so now you have gotten to this now let us now tick in the point that we are working with so you will tick in this one so you're ticking this one you will tick in this one you will tick in this one just like this then tick in here as well then tick in here as well then tick in here as well tick in here as well right and then tick in here as well just like this then tick in this other one from here to this form right and then tick in this one as well tick in all of these ones so this will be the pattern that you will use to be cutting your combat pockets you see that we have brought out the real shape now the last thing to do here is to mark half an inch at this point from the side of the one inch half an inch here and then half an inch here so you also need to thicken it so from here you know you thicken this one to this point and then you flush it to here so this one comes from here it goes all through this way and then comes to this point right so now the next thing to do is to add 0 0.5 round this area so i will take my red marker so that you understand let's use the let's use the red marker so now how then do you do that mark 0 0.5 inch here 0 0.5 inch here 0 0.5 inch here 0 0.5 inch here 0 0.5 inch is already marked here right fine then go all through this way as well 0 0.5 0 0.5 0 0.5 0 0.5 and then 0 0.5 right so let us now take in the allowances with our red marker so you go from here to this point then go all through out this way right go all through out this way go all out from here this way so the red marker signifies the sewing allowances right which you need so go all through out from here this way and then continue from here as well go all through out this way and then let this meet with this go all through out to this point go all through out to this very point 
this will be 0 0.5 as well, right? Half an inch as well, so it's bent. I will correct it this way, and then from here, let's get this one first. So take this one to go down this way, and let this one into this. So now the red marker signifies all the sewing allowances right so as you can see this is the pocket so i can still label it should in case you have a confusion on how to do this so here the distance from here to here was eight inches that let me write eight by seven inches Right? This is 8 and this is 7. Then here is 1 inch. Here is 1 inch. And here is also 1 inch. And here is also 1 inch. And here is half, 0 0.5. Here is 1 inch. And here is 1 inch. And here is one inch. Here is also one inch. Right? So these are the measurements that you will use to mark out or draft out your pocket. So if you derive this video interesting, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. So I will cut out this, then we will go to the next video, which will be on the cut sewing on fabric proper.